Hello everyone, Randy Rogers, Mortgage Loan Originator here again. I hope today finds you happy, healthy, especially, and blessed. Today, let's talk renting versus buying just a bit. Did you know, according to Apartment List's National Rent Report, rental rates went up $300 per month in 2021. And sources like MBS Highway and others expect this trend to continue in 2022, perhaps at a slightly slower pace. Look, I've been there before, particularly when I was a young adult. There were perks, like not having to do my own maintenance and having a nice pool to use. Of course, getting maintenance to show up in a timely manner was sometimes tricky. Uh, if you're currently renting or considering renting, while you may have a roof over your head and included refrigerator repairs, renting doesn't help you build wealth like home ownership does. For example, that aforementioned extra $300 per month you're spending on rent based on current rates would be like having a $70,000 mortgage. Meaning, if you were to use that extra $300 per month to purchase a house, you would have an additional $70,000 in buying power that you could put towards purchasing your dream home. Additionally, when you purchase a home, that property continues to appreciate and amortize, helping you build wealth. But if you decide to rent, the only person building wealth through real estate is your landlord. If you're a renter in the great state of Texas, contact me and I will send you a breakdown of what it looks like in your specific market. Then we can chat to see if home ownership is the right option for you. You can contact me through trinityoaksmortgage.com slash R-R-O-D-G-E-R-S. Have a blessed day.